Well, guys, the moment you're waiting for, it's over. It's time to review for its 10th anniversary and a show that I used to watch when I was a kid called The Amazing World of Gumball came in the year 10 years ago in 2011. Let's get started. Hi guys, Mr. Bell Tessa here, and, and I hope you guys enjoy my DVD update I got on CDS. That was a lot of fun to make. And I've topic stuff before the review. Next month is my birthday. And next month is my 15th anniversary. And I gotta do a lot of events on my 15th anniversary. Like going lot to a lot to a special launch, going to the bowling or arcade, etc. But in the meantime, I'm going to review on a show I used to watch when I was a kid called The Amazing World Gumball. And by the way, happy 10th anniversary to this show. Man, what does the time have begun? Seriously. Came in the year... Um, Gumball. Came in the year in 2011, same year as Winnie Pooh 2011, Rio, etc. Let's tell the plot. So, basic plot is, it's about a blue cat named Gumball who has, who has two characters, who has, two, who has friends called Darwin, who has its own brother called Darwin, and its sister called Aeneas. They go on great adventures, going going on, going on adventures in Elmore, this is the city that they live, and that's basically what the plot is. And that's how basically the plot is. Now guys, now guys, the first time I discovered this show is many years ago. That's right. I discovered this show many years ago. Back in 2000, 2011. No joke. I discovered this show in 2011. On the year when the show came out. I think on summer 2011. Because uh, Cartoon was still in my country at that time. And I first watched the show in 2012 on Boy. That's right. First time I watched this show is in 2012. The, and believe it or not, the very first episode, the very first episode is, the very first episode I watched is The Depth, which is from season one. No joke. The very first episode is the episode where Mr. Robinson says, says, na 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 na, da na na na, da na 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 that when they goes to Elmo Senior Town School, and Gum and and Mr. Robinson, when Mr. Robinson went to a town show and they sang one of the songs, and after that when he says, "What all the glass broke," especially Miss Mrs. Robinson's car. Good times and the final part where Mr. Robinson's. Spelled by Darwin in the Ice Watterson. That was the most nostalgic episode. I just wish Boy and Girl bring back season one. The, the episode. Ah, good times. This is the very first episode I watched from the Amazing War of Gumball. Gumball. Scratch that. This is the very first Gumball episode that I was born. That I was, that I just watched, sorry guys, just turned in. This is the very first Gumball episode I just watched. The episode, which is the depth. That was a great nostalgic episode from my childhood. Now, speaking of characters, and what so? What do you think of the show? It still holds up to this day. I think Musical Gumball is a fantastic British Cartoon Network show. It is just as good as a better time regular show and we bear bears and the girls. I mean, that's just amazing for your masterpieces as well. Which is still miss a better time than regular show this day. They curse you teen times ago for causing this joke, guys. I don't do that anymore on my channel because because it's only cutting out well because of the low ratings. This this premise of the show is actually great. I actually really like the story. 
the characters we know and love from from the show were fantastic characters. Let's talk about the characters. The characters. Gumball is a really likable character, and he is definitely my favorite character to show. Gumball, no, no competition. He's definitely one of my favorite episodes of favorite characters of of the show. Sorry, guys, just starting in. Darwin is really awesome. Rod Darwin is really hilarious, especially his his good. No, ho, ho, ho. Why? Why? That quote, I remember the quote. That was from the dress episode, which that episode pff, didn't age well. And then it's, it's really likable. He's a she's a really likable character to her brothers, to her brothers Darwin and Gumball. And and believe it or not, he had a boyfriend surprisingly, which I don't remember his name this name because I haven't seen the show in a long time, in quite some times. So I plan to watch. I plan to. I plan to see some of them. Might gonna kind of rewatch it when if when the characters when the characters when the characters where that character is. I think it was. I remember that that blue guy. That blue guy. Don't remember its name. Which I would check its name right now. Which is from that classy family. Which is Billy, Billy. That's right, Billy. One of one of NAA's best friends. I knew him. Now Billy is a great character. Especially is good. Mom, are we there yet? That was from the episode of the Extras. Uh, Richard is absolutely hilarious. Episode Nicole is is really likable. Yeah, he can be. She can be being to gumball Dominic and I sometimes so she's a likable character. Manager is absolutely hilarious. I'm not gonna talk about the characters because there's a lot of characters. The animation, it still holds up. The animation still holds up. And believe it or not, they had a new show this year called Alien from Earth, which Alien from Earth is is had potential. I'm yet to watch Alien from Earth. This will be a great show. This will be a really great show, Alien from Earth. I want to watch Elliot from Earth, and guys, if you see Elliot from Earth, do not give me away spoilers for this movie. And Billy and it's the ambassador. Spoilers because I hate spoilers with a burning passion for the episodes. The story is actually very good. The story the, has a, has the same premise as the show. As for Sorry guys, oh god, I'm sorry guys, back and saying guys, and this, this is easily one of the best British shows I, of, I've ever seen in my life, and this show ran for six seasons, this show was so good, and it ran, because this, and this, but that this show ran for six seasons, and this show has a total, has a total of 100 and, of two, sorry, 240 episodes. Man, what does the time have begun? This is one of the longest running Cartoon Network shows from the British ages. And yes, Alien from Earth is now on Cartoon Network, which I want to watch Alien from Earth. And guys, do not give me away spoilers from the episodes. Do not give me away spoilers for coming below. Overall, Musical Gumball is a fantastic Cartoon Network show that I will remember it with all my heart because I, I used to watch the show a lot when I was a kid, and boy, especially. Uh, mornings and after school as well, and I do watch the show a lot, a lot with Clarence back in 2017, which I'm yet to review on Clarence very soon, for to contribute its, its to contribute, its tenth anniversary I think I think I'm gonna review Clarence next. I'm not really sure. Overall, it get it definitely gets you guess it a ten out of ten. It's an amazing, brilliant masterpiece. So that's my review on Amazing Old Gumball. My next review is hopefully, I repeat, hopefully the Fairly Odd Parents to contribute the late, the late, for, the, the Fairly Odd Parents. I get to review Fairly Odd Parents. I might review Fairly Parents in next week. Who knows, guys? Times can tell. Thank you guys for watching. Subscribe to my channel. Like and share with friends. Until next time, goodbye. I forgot, I forgot, I forgot. And guess what's best of all, guys? It's getting a movie. Uh, when I when I check out what it's got, I'm gonna have a movie. 
I said to myself, yes, Gummo is getting a movie, finally, about damn time. It, and it's going to be a teamy movie. Man, I wish it would be released in cinemas because I want to see Gumball in a big screen. I want to see how Gumball started its life. I want to see how Darwin has origin and I have how, what, how the Iron Eyes was born. So that would be pretty interesting. And this show was produced by Cartoon Network Independent Studio Europe. When I was a kid, I thought it was going to be a Cartoon Network Studios show. No joke, this is going to be made by Cartoon Network Studios. I didn't know that. And I and I just saw some episodes of the Comic Chronicles on on Boeing, and they're great. Thank us watching. Goodbye. Thanks for watching my video. Remember to subscribe sub to my channel for more videos. I love you, Ignore Alfie and close the water tower. See you guys on the next video. Bye.